Leicester 34 16 Gloucester, Johnny May at the double to earn timely win for Tigers. It was May's day to prevent May Day at Leicester as Johnny May scored twice against his former club to ease concern at Welford Road, if only slightly. Only their second win in 11 matches since late October, victory hardly stops the rot, but does force Leicester back into the populated Premiership mid-table pack. They scored four tries and George Ford did not miss a kick, taking 19 points in a busy, controlling man-of-the-match display. Jordan Murphy was delighted. We haven't taken advice and gone to the pub, said the head coach. We haven't gone paintballing, we have just worked hard. John is world class and he is always going to up for it against Gloucester. I was a bit concerned in the 65th minute when he made a break but it was cramp. We got him off pretty quickly. He'll be important for the whole country in the coming weeks. Leicester, Holmes, May, Tilagi, Tuumu, Aloafla, Ford, Captain, Youngs, Genge, Polotino, Cole, Fitzgerald, Kitchener, Williams, Evans, Kalimafoni replacements, Kerr, Bateman, Hayes, Wells, O'Connor, White, Eastman, Worth tries, May 2nd, Holmes, Ford Con, Ford for Penn, Ford to Gloucester, Hudson, Sharples, 12 Trees, Atkinson, Bunahan, Williams, Brally, Honeck, Vizagi, Balmain, Grobler, Most Hurt, Clark, Evans, Morgan, Captain, Replacements, Walker, McAllister, Knight, Slater, Ludlow, Velakot, Trinder, Seabrook TRY, Evans Con, 12 Trees Benz, 12 Trees 3 Referee, Wayne Barnes, RFU, Attendance, 20,329 Leicester pretty much had this one wrapped up with 55 minutes completed, they were 27-6 up and cruising after May had scored twice to hit 10 for the season, the second probably thanks to a forward pass and Jonah Holmes once, after a deft inside pass from Matt to Umua. But they then became excited relishing the prospect of back-to-back -back home wins for the first time since March, and let Gloucester back in. Gareth Evans picked off a forward pass and bustled in, then Billy 12 Drees knocked over a penalty, which suddenly gave a previously spluttering Gloucester a lifeline. But in the spirit of turning over a new leaf in the new year, unlike in 2018, Lester saw at home. Ford had the crucial score. He ghosted through a gap out wide and leapt in the air, mimicking May's celebration for his second earlier, and the sighs of relief were audible. Tigers had a bonus point, and they deserved it. There was more fizz in attack, more bite in defense and the scrums looked far more Lester-like. To salute that Dan Cole was roared off when he left the field, a timely performance heralded for the discarded England man. It is no coincidence Gloucester, refreshingly rampant in the early season, looked bereft in Danny Cipriani's absence. That is now three losses in four without him, and he might not be risked for Munster on Friday. Do you prepare him for one game when his full fitness is a maybe? Said boss Johan Ackerman or do you get him ready for the next block of games? He wants to show what he can do but we have to be clever. Jordan Aloafla might have been awarded an incredibly acrobatic try at the end, but it was ruled out for a knock-on. Nevertheless, the win was still Leicester's and the Tannoy blasted out hole again, not quite yet, but they did look more like tigers than kittens, atomic or otherwise.